Okay. So I'm finally back with the um, uh, unboxing of the Hyperdimension Neptunia U Action Unleashed. Um, and I've actually been very confused uh, about the name because in Japanese, as I recall, it's Neptunia U. Uh, something, something, I don't recall, but here it's Hyperdimension. And uh, I hope to also uh, be able to, uh, what's it called, do an unboxing on uh, Rebirth 2, uh, or unboxing, show off of what's in it, and uh, uh, have a devotion Blackheart soon. But uh, <laughs> I have been kind of busy with uh, stuff like uh, trying to catch up to the animes uh, I haven't watched. Uh, currently, um, I managed to catch up on Yamada and the Seven Witches, and uh, kind of also uh, high school DxD which um, I actually like high school DxD I had totally forgotten how great it was if you can get past the fan service but as uh, you can see we open the box and then we have this little what's it called uh, the little cassette or yeah I guess you can call it the box but and it is a box. Let's just call it the box. What's in the box? For people who get that uh, reference. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Here is the box. And let's see. It says that it requires memory card. And also, I'm not sure if you can see it or if I'm too close. I really wish I had um, a... Uh, Two seconds. I had a hair yeah, sitting in uh, in my mouth. Uh, not sitting uh, in my mouth. <laughs> That's the issue with having uh, the beard. But uh, as I was saying, I, I really wish I had a professional camera so I could, uh, you know, see what uh, I record while I recorded it. That would be pretty nice. But we have two new characters. Um, I can't recall the name. I think it's Stinky. Uh, no, I think that's Stinky, and I can't recall her name. Oh well, let's open it. Hmm. Oh, and it's also compatible with uh, what's it called PlayStation TV. So, you who only have a PlayStation TV or PS Vita TV, as I call it, can also enjoy this title. Yes, that's the cartridge. I may try it out later today to take a little relax from the anime. We will see. So underneath, uh, yeah, we have the soundtrack. Give me a second to open it. Let's be careful with opening the soundtrack because I really don't like when uh, you get that little scratch. It's not uh, visible, but you can feel it with your fingers. And I would say it's... Okay. That is... I don't know if I like that they uh, turned it this way, so uh, when you look here, it has no side. Uh, you can see the soundtrack. I don't know. Uh, but I understand why they did it, because they didn't include this uh, battle soundtrack, which is hmm, a pretty interesting um, way to do it. It's in a spiral. Let's see what there is. Nip, nip, yes. I'm feeling lucky. Hello. World. Perfect purple. Black, brave, white wings. Greedy green. Eager edition. I edit battle tonic. My battle is toxic. Battle is romance. Battle is cruel. Boss of dust. Ah, <laughs> oh, that reference. Nightmare innocence and Yukichi. Yeah, let's 
I think that is connected to those two. Since that sounds very Japanese, let's see what's underneath here. Hmm. Now I can't recall exactly what should be in here, but this one. This one. I know it's not the best go, which we all know is Noir. Or a sister Uni. And if necessary, we can take uh, Iris Heart. Actually, we would most likely put Iris Heart higher than I would put uh, Uni. But that's just me. But we all know that those three is the only best girls. I have not seen uh, Uzume, which is uh, in the uh, hybrid I mentioned, Neptunia Victory 2. So I can say if I like her. I could always ask my friend. And in case you wonder, what is this? And this is actually one of the reasons that I bought the, uh, the limited edition. Also the fact that I have almost all of them. Only missing the first type that I mentioned, Neptunia. And then I have all of them. It's basically what you call... Yeah, I thought so. At, at the Makura. Uh, two seconds. I try to see if I can get it. So, so you can see fully. But I, I knew, knew they had cut corners. So there's nothing on the side. And in case you wonder if that's normal. No, it's not. Let me get you. I own Daku Makura, and uh, before I show you it, <laughs> it may not be suitable for younger audiences, but here you see one of the sides, this is the uh, yeah, safe for work I will call it, I actually think, okay, this is a little less safe for work, this is the one I normally sleep over. But I'm gonna change it uh, to that uh, Neptune one. Uh, even thought it uh, only have it on one side because then I can at least know which side to turn uh, towards the wall because that's the side without anything. But uh, that's basically the collector's edition of um, uh, how did I mention Neptunia? Hmm. It's actually very. It's okay. I I have some better, but they are also pretty expensive. But um, that's pretty much the collector's edition. So um, I think I will stop here. Um, and oh yeah. Uh, by the way, uh, for those that uh, ask me where is my witches, uh, which I uh, play, uh, let's play. Um, as I said, I've been busy with uh, catching up to anime. I actually hope to be much longer forward in uh, the series than I am now. But uh, doing reviews of them takes a little time. So that's it. And in case you wonder where I have the review, um, I recently um, discovered how the collection thing works on uh, Google Play. Uh, yeah, not Google Play, Google Plus, and you will find that on my uh, profile, uh, uh, my Google Plus profile under collection, there's an uh, anime and a uh, uh, manga collection. And uh, just the thing, if I say there um, is a risk or something of um, not safe for work content, <laughs> believe me, there is not safe for work content, especially with high school DxD. But I'll end it here and see you later with. Hmm. Maybe I should finally get uh, this unboxed. So uh, I'll see you. Mm.